We have a new world record in the women's 4x100 meter medley relay in the short course version of the pool. The relay team from the Cali Condors broke the world record in time of 344.52 at the ISL Championships in Budapest, Hungary. And in this video, we're gonna break it down. We're gonna watch the full race with my commentary and annotations, and then we're gonna break it down and look at just how fast each of these swimmers were able to go to break the world record. Without further ado, let's begin the video. So we're watching the Cali Condors swim this race. We're gonna have Olivia Smoliga take things out for the Cali Condors, and she was absolutely flying. Keep an eye on her, she is right there, I believe. And she went out in a, in a very fast time, 55 seconds. You know, later in the competition, she was able to actually lower the time that she set right here in the leadoff leg. The official world record that they were able to set is a 344.52. The prior world record, I'll write it down for you guys, 44.52. The prior world record was a 355. Whoop, back up. 345, what am I doing? 345.20. So if we watch Smoliga, she's really cranking right there. Whoop, there she is. Clear that. Now, she's getting some pressure in the lane above her, but she's gonna turn and they're gonna have the lead into the first length. Yep, there she is. She is taking over the lead, keep an eye on her. Into the second position. That is Lily King diving in. Olivia Smoliga split a 55.60. Prior world record, uh, Team USA, the duel in the pool was a 56.08 by Courtney Bartholomew. She's actually uh, from Michigan. I'm from Michigan, shout out to the Michigan fam. And Lily King is just rocking away. She is just killing this right now. Um, you know, she is extending the lead. Lily King is the gold medalist in this event world record holder in the long course version as well. She's got a bunch of accolades. She's 55 in yards, I believe, and touches in a 124.7. And they're just they're just running away with it. In the breaststroke, you know, driving with the hands forward, keeping the thumb, you know, on the surface of the water. And in the uh, analysis video I did on how she went the 55, you know, we break down some of the fundamentals of the stroke. You know, breaststroke is really leg driven. It's body driven. You gotta be moving on top of the water. Breaststroke is the slowest stroke. There you can see her really driving forward with the hands, forward progress, not a lot of up and down. And she's gonna hand it off to her teammate, Kelsey Dahlia, uh, who dives in there and they have, you know, multiple body length lead at this point. So Lily King was able to split a 102.40. Prior world record split was Kylie Miley and she won a 102.40. Point eight. So, you know, we're just dropping time at every part of the race right now. And Kelsey Dahlia right there just extending the lead. A little bit of a floater into that turn. You know, not sure if we had a little bit more magic into this, into this split here, third length. And, and you know, the, the, the order in the individual medley relay is different than the individual medley standalone. The medley relay, you go backstroke, breaststroke, butterfly, freestyle. The individual medley is fly back, breast free. So butterfly is the third leg. You get a dive fresh with a relay start, making great forward progress. The rest of the pool is behind her and she is going to touch splitting a 54.79. That is amazing. Uh, you know, what's fun is that she was part of the 2015 relay that broke the original world record and she split a 55.0 in that race. So she definitely improved upon her own swim. Into the water now is Erica Brown. Uh, prior uh, world record holder in this relay leg position was Simone Manuel. And Simone Manuel, if you don't know, she's the the Olympic gold medalist in the long course, 100 meter freestyle. Uh, and in that relay in 2015, when they broke the world record, Simone Manuel won a 51.23. So that is absolutely flying. Erica Brown was a little bit off of that. Erica Brown did split a 51.73. So about half a second slower than Simone Manuel, but all the other legs were faster by about half a second. And that allowed uh, the overall relay time to be a world record. And look at them, they're all pumped up and they should be because the world record uh, means a lot. It means you're the fastest of all time in that specific discipline. Pretty cool to do it at the ISL Championships and to have four American swimmers. So it's not only a world record in the team race, but it's also an American record. And all of these team members could be potentially
eventually together again in maybe an Olympic Games or another championships representing their country. So uh, with that being said, we're going to go ahead and just recap the race results here. So the overall time was a 344.52, super, super fast. And that was split out by Olivia Smoliga, who you, ha who you see right here. She was able to go out in a 55.60. Then we had Lily King go a 1. 02.40. Then we had Kelsey Dahlia go a 54.79 with the anchor Erica Brown going a 51.73. These times are blazing and they deserve everything right there. It was a fantastic race. If you guys enjoyed this technical analysis, make sure you subscribe, like this video. Let me know in the comments what you think and make sure you check out all the other analysis videos that I've done and not only ISL races, but other world record performance swims and also top swims by top swimmers like Michael Phelps, Katie Ledecky, Caleb Dressel, Adam Peaty, all of those analysis videos looking at the stroke technique from multiple angles, so that way you can see how the best in the world are swimming, where they can improve, and how you can apply that to your own swimming so you can swim faster and smarter than ever before. Now, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you check out the first link in the description. That is the My Swim Pro Global Facebook group. It's a private group, but it's completely free to join. All you have to do is request to join it. Make sure you, you say that you came from the YouTube channel, wherever you're, fi you're watching this video, we have thousands of swimmers from over 100 countries who are in there trying to swim faster and smarter than ever before. So if that sounds like you and you're trying to take your swimming to the next level, make sure you join that group. Make sure you download the My Swim Pro app for workouts, training programs, videos, analytics, all those different things to keep you motivated to get better and improve upon yourself. It's all there available for you. Let me know in the comments what you think. Wishing you guys the best. Happy swimming and have a great day.